in Greene County, a piece of history devastated. You're looking at a home that has been a family for six generations. It survived two floods, deep snows and so much more. After Helene swept through, water reached the, to the top of the second floor. Is that bad? Oh, 10 News reporter Ellis Rold is explaining how this family is now starting to rebuild. A historic home in Greene County that's been in a family for six generations. After devastating flooding from Hurricane Helene, that family and hundreds of community members are rebuilding. George Birdwell's family has owned this home since the mid 1800s. Devastating flooding from Helene tried to wash some of that history away. A lot of love yeah. came into this house and a lot of love went out. 200 year old hats or 200 year old Bibles or everything she held came out right here. For more than a century, families have used this foyer and home as a wedding venue, a place that celebrated so many unities has once again brought people together. We couldn't see through here day one. You know, Saturday morning, this was all, we can see right now everything, but this was completely clogged. There was uh, a massive debris field right here. Flood water filled the house to the top of its second story. And the watermark is, you can see it real well on this water wallpaper. It absorbed the water well, but in this, in this part of the room, we'd still be underwater. The family says day by day, they'll rebuild. And that was job one. Mm -hmm. Just if you can get a little sunlight in, it lifts your spirit and it's easier to take that next step. Now, since we've been here, we've seen dozens of people come in and out of this house trying to help this family start the process of rebuilding. They tell me it's just another chapter in its nearly 200 year long history. And that was Ellis Rold reporting. The family says the support from the community, first responders and law enforcement, it's been overwhelming.